What do you be doing? It's a board contest here, and today we are reacting to the new Nintendo Direct. Let's just cut to the chase and just talk about what the what the heck this Nintendo Direct is gonna bring. My predictions, okay. Hear me out. No. We are either gonna get some Zelda stuff, like a movie or a game, or maybe some new Animal Crossing, or a new Mario Party. Or something that I've been wanting for a very long time. A Tomotachi Life remake. Or a new do uh, new Tomotachi Life. Bro, you guys don't know how much I played of Tomotachi Life. I played the absolute sh crap out of Tomotachi Life. Because I was also lonely. But yeah, those are my predictions. And literally, y'all, I'm telling you this right now. If we get a Tobo Tachi life, like a new Tobo Tachi life, I'm going to die happy. But again, knowing the title direct, we're, it's mostly wrong. So we might get so incredibly like different and just completely out of left field. But yeah, y'all, without no further ado, let's get straight into it. Let's go. Let's go! Okay. <gasps> this style! I think I remember this. This was on the DS, right? I never played it, though. Oh, wow. Is this a remake? I know this style. It was on the DS. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm 100% playing this. Oh my god, I'm 100% playing this. I'm already sold. Like, you don't gotta tell me twice. Wow. This was on the DS. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Wow. This art style is like iconic. <laughs> is this a remake or is this like a completely new thing? Dude. I'm going to play this. Oh my gosh. What the heck? They turn it to a, a saucer. I like that they made the explanation point a freaking L. I saw that. Wow. Like I'm already sold. <laughs> this looks epic though. Dude. Yeah, what is it? Brothership? Is this a remake? I don't think so. November 7th, 2024. What? Hello, everyone. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be I can't bow because freaking my mic. Direct. I just bowed into my mic. <laughs> that was the first new entry in the Mario and Luigi series in almost nine years. Mario yeah. And Luigi Brothership. Please look forward to a seafaring adventure that unfolds across mysterious islands, as well as evolved bros moves with Mario and Luigi. Oh, that's going to be sick. Okay, let's see the first batch of headlines. Oh, man. Bring the championships home or on the go. I remember this. The thrill of the Nintendo yep, World I had this on the Wii U. The I just never played system. it. Oh yeah, it's gonna be completely unedited. Speed running challenges from across so if I make NES awkward games, stuff, then like, I'm sorry. Familiarize yourself with each challenge and perfect your timing. Dude, is this this then is coming to the Switch, right? Shot and aim for the top of the online. Oh. Leaderboards. You can also try more difficult legend challenges. Oh wow. Like completing Super Mario Brothers in one go using warp pipes. That's crazy. Stuck on a legend challenge? 
Check out classified information for handy tips and tricks to help you improve. Put your skills to the test in survival wow. mode, where you'll race against ghost data of players worldwide. After each round, half of the players will be eliminated. You've only got one shot to survive. Will you be the last Dude, one I kind of wish I was like born in this Nintendo era. World I bet you like NES this edition. was just Launches peak gaming Nintendo right Switch, here. July 18th. But just looking back, like it's just pixels. <laughs> now on Nintendo e oh, July 18th. A deluxe set containing a physical version of the game and other bonus items is also available for pre-order. All right. The final battle of Fairy Tale is about to begin. Fairy Tale. Ikuto, happy. Dude, you know what's crazy? I could never get into fairy tale. In this action RPG, I could never get into fairy tale. I don't know why I couldn't get into it. I tried three times, but I just couldn't get into it. Or for some reason, my sister and my dad are obsessed with this. I'm like, I guess it's just me. That's a me issue. And sometimes it'd be like that. But I know fairy tale. Teammates to take down powerful enemies. Fairy Tale Two launches on Nintendo Switch hmm. this winter. All right. Embark on a multi-dimensional journey. Whoa! This looks like Jump From Force. Final Fantasy series creator Hironobu Sakaguchi. And composer Nobuo Uematsu comes the turn based RPG Fantasia. Bro, I remember before I started YouTube, I tried to um, get into Final Fantasy. It was cool. Like, I got it through half of the game, <laughs> then I just stopped. But, dude, you know a game that I would get into? Kingdom of Hearts. I would 100% get to Kingdom of Hearts. To target multiple enemies at Trust once. me, if there's like a new Kingdom of Hearts game like coming out, like I would play it. Send enemies you've encountered to a separate dimension and fight them later. The more enemies there are, the more you can wipe out in one shot. Oh, let's see. Let them go. Now, let us save the world together. Fantasian Neo Dimension launches. That's on a Nintendo goofy Switch robot. Oh, this, this is not even freaking Final Fantasy. I was like, where's Sephiroth? Oh, it wasn't. Wow. Another sport is coming to Spoko Square. Huh? What? Basketball? Added as a free update to the Nintendo Switch sports game. No way, bro. Dribble, pass, and shoot. In two on two matches using what I was wondering if they were gonna add anything Try else to this challenge solo and score as many baskets as you can. What? Up to four players can also compete in five. No battles. way. Oh, yeah, I'm not gonna play this. Local, like, come you can on, team up with players worldwide in two on two online matches, uh, uh, dude. No way. I'm gonna play this. Like, I'm letting y'all know that right now. This free update for Nintendo Switch Sports dunks its way onto Nintendo Switch. Summer, okay. Summer. Oh, that's so cool, man. I guess I really like that game. Whoa. Oh, what is this? I like the design. Whoa. Yo, the music is bumping. Was that? 
It's an Bio. Cartoon classics. Cartoon classics. We've been to a new update for Disney Illusion Island. Monoth's greatest detective is solving a mystery, and only Mickey and friends can help. In the brand new adventure, so Mystery about and Monoth, uncover hints and evidence scattered throughout the world, then use the dashboard to crack each case. What mm. big secret lies at the end? Start sleuthing, because this free update launches on Nintendo Switch later today. Oh. So like they do stuff Island like that. Adventures await. Customize your character. Then befriend Hello Kitty, Karomi, and other familiar faces in this. Oh, there's Hello Kitty. <laughs> Team up with your Why does this look like Animal Crossing? Mysteries and restore Friendship Island when Hello Kitty Island Adventure launches as a timed console exclusive on the Nintendo Switch system next year. Hmm. <laughs> Let's get loony in this wacky sports game. Whoa, wasn't this Bugs Bunny, Daffy Duck, already a thing? Pig, I think this is a remake. Four arcade style I think, right? Unleash the full power of Acme across iconic levels in up to four-player local co-op. But watch out for falling and Bro, why does it look like what is it called? Mario like sports? This fall. That's not what it's called. I think I think that's what it's called. Emergency meeting. Oh my gosh. rolls are being added to among us. Alert others when Yo, I completely forgot a about a monkey. Man, Plant I wish I had a YouTube channel back then. Because or I we definitely would have played it. Taking out players as a oh my gosh, and I would have definitely been the worst liar. Free update for Among Us sneaks onto Nintendo Switch later today. Wow. A monster army is at your command. Raise your own monster this army. This is Dog, a realm of monsters. Those who command and raise them are called Farmagia and play a vital role in the land's civilization. That Ten demon line. Farmagia must rise up against the Bro, why is this a fairy tale style? Like, reign of the underworld. can the character like get at least a little raise bit creative? And lead them into the fight against the Magus's army. Like, you know what I mean? You know that like other anime, and the Colton Eden Zero? Literally, he looked like Asta and the other looked like that blue cat thing. I'm like, bro, can you get they creative? Can be trained for battle. I don't know. It just they just look the same. Give commands to your monsters and exploit enemy weaknesses in action packed combat. Oh that oh that's kinda cool. I like games like this. Merge all of the battle buttons. Or you have your own army. To call forth a giant fusion summon and wreak havoc on your foes. Oh yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Join the rebellion to stop the Magus in Farmagia, launching on Nintendo Switch November 1st. That's cool. Uh oh. <gasps> a remake? No way! Country Returns, originally released on the Wii system, is barreling on Nintendo oh, Switch. Oh, wow! In HD. The villainous Tiki Tap tribe has. I never got to play this game. And stolen Donkey Kong's precious banana horde. I never got to play this game. Obstacles in the oh way. Oh my Just god! Found him. I never got to play this and one. On oh my gosh! I no really might play this. Bananas. From manic minecarts. I really might play this. To high flying rocket barrels. Oh my gosh, dude. This and looks awesome. Rambo or Rambi, I think. There are plenty of transportation wow. methods available. Pass a joy wow. controller to a local co -op. I'm really gonna play this. 80 appealing levels are in store. Including the additional levels from the Nintendo 3DS version. What? Oh, dang, we're getting everything. Donkey Kong Country Returns HD. What? 2025? System, January 16th. Day! One of Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong's jungle escapades returns in HD. Wow. I'm definitely gonna play that. Oh my gosh. Are in store with these Kongs. Next, please take a look at this. 
Oh dang, I'm ready. This looks like Zelda, not even gonna lie. The time is nigh. Oh, Dragon Quest. <laughs> Sorry, it looked like it. I know the pixel stuff looks pretty cool, but I like the realisticness around them. It's not everything's not pixel. Pixel? Pixel. Like, you know what I mean? Oh, it's a remake. Dragon Quest 3. Journey with allies to face the Arch Fiend on an epic adventure. Memorable encounters. Perplexing challenges. <laughs> and formidable monsters await. An iconic RPG remade in HD 2D. Yeah, this yeah, that looks cool. Forge your own path. The legacy begins. Dragon Quest 3 HD 2D Remake. I love the music, bro. Coming to Nintendo Switch November 14th. Okay. Huh? Oh, sorry. I'm not a Dragon Quest fan, so I don't know what that means. <laughs> the Ed, uh, Erd, uh, the Erdrick trilogy. Nintendo Direct. Konnichiwa. Hori Yuji desu. Oh. Dragon Quest Three の映像いかがでしたか？ようやく発売日を発表できて僕も嬉しく思います。そして、サプライズで発表したドローンクエスト1&2も80D2D で読み上げることが決定しました。時系列としてはスリーが物語の始めるとなっており、スリー1&2どちらも是非楽しんでも
Wait, what? Customize all sorts of outfits. Decorate your island however you'd like. And more. What? Plus, up to four players in local co-op can team up to what catch is special Dempa Man. The new Dempa Man, Man is free to play and launches as a timed exclusive on Nintendo Switch July 22nd. A time exclusive? It's only going to be out limited time? Strategize away in this tower defense installment of the Metal Slug series. Take control of your forces and pulverize what any the stronghold. Heck? Choose from over 300 units with different abilities and build out your decks to win tactical tussles. Oh, that's cool. You can also slug it out with other What the heck? Those things right there look like from the movie Atlas. Metal slug attack reloaded. Storms onto the Nintendo Switch the system arcs. later today. Dang, dude. Embark on an expedition of the dam in this eagerly awaited sequel to the gothic roguelike RPG. Board your stagecoach and set off across a decaying landscape to prevent an apocalypse. Fight off nightmarish fiends in turn-based combat. Dude, I'd never play like a, an apocalypse-like type game. Your abilities after each I think run. does Biomute? No, Biomute don't count. Dungeon two Maybe, but no, not like Nintendo this. Switch, July fifteenth. Pre-orders begin later today on Nintendo eShop. More classic titles are on the way. Hmm. Oh, what the heck? Play Link's classic 16-bit adventure and team up online to explore randomized dungeons in The Legend of Zelda, <laughs> A Link to the Past Four Swords. It's cool that they put online with these, like, old games because it's, it could be so much better Experience online. Experience the remake of Samus' first adventure in Metroid Zero Mission. Wow. Plus, coming to the new <laughs> Nintendo 64, Nintendo Switch Online Mature, mature 17. 17 Plus collection of games. Brave the dangerous lost oh. land to stop the campaigner's nefarious schemes. Yo, they should Turok, add like conquer. Dinosaur hunter. That now that's 17 plus. And don't tell me. Oh, I don't, know. I don't know what this is. Their alien conspiracy Why does this remind me of freaking um Sal Gear? Online multiplayer. Or 007. <laughs> All four games will be available for Nintendo Switch Online Plus expansion pack. Oh, that's cool. Later today. That's cool. They're really bringing Set the old games back. To save the day. The heck is this? This is Verona, a young woman with the ability to communicate with phantoms. I will take all of this girl. Join her on a journey to save her friend Ash. in this new installment in the Phantom Brave series. Why does this remind me of freaking what's that game? Genshin Impact? I don't know why. Based battles, where you'll combine the phantoms you befriended with freaking sucked at that game. Ways. Genshin Impact. Combine phantoms with certain objects to maneuver them. Oh, that's cool. Combine with a cannon to attack a large area. A fan to blow enemies around, or combine with Morona herself. I like that combining objects that can turn the tide of battle. Phantom Brave, the Lost Hero, launches on Nintendo Switch next year. Okay. This one's gonna take you for a ride. Why? Seven arcade games featuring Marvel and Capcom characters oh, are finding that's their cool. way onto Nintendo Switch as one collection. Clash in X-Men vs. Street Fighter. Duke it out in Marvel vs. Capcom 2. I remember that, Marvel vs. Capcom. Take down the Kingpin in the beat-em-up side scroller, the Punisher, and more. I really like they're bringing old games back. To polish your fighting skills and combos. Select online mode to challenge rivals around the world. Like I said, like online, like it's back then there was no such thing as online. You can also cross over to the museum to view artwork or listen to music from each game. 
Marvel vs. Capcom Fighting Collection. Hey, yo, what the heck is that song called? It was just right there, but freaking. Cool. Huh? No! What? The latest game in the Mario Party series what? Place on an enormous island resort. A new the Mario Party? The biggest selection of Mario Party mini games yet in what? Super Mario Party Jamboree. Jamboree? First, let's see some of the new boards where you'll compete to collect the most stars. What well, this was on the Nintendo 64. The escalators to travel between floors in Rainbow Galleria. Use what? Game coins to get a star at half price when they're on flash sale. What the heck is that character? Ninji? Ride around and stay on track in Rollum Raceway. With the new Turbo Dice item. Wait, I got a question. Is this a controller? Not on now freaking the ebb and flow of the tide. The freaking joysticks and things really get mixed up when the blows its top. Along with five new game boards, two boards from previous Mario yep. games. Yep, I, I caught return. that. I caught that. I caught so that. Many games are action packed challenges. What? Trials, a battle of wits, and more. And some are controlled by gently shaking. Or oh, yeah, this is on the. I might make an exception. With over 110 mini games. There's a wide variety to enjoy. Wow. Also. Uh what? 20 players can go head to head online in the what? mode. Compete against your rivals and aim for first place. Try your best. What, dude? Y'all know I'm playing this. I already got this game. The biggest Mario Party yet will soon be underway. When the Super Mario Party Jamboree game launches on the Nintendo Switch system October 7th. What, dude? I never thought it was going to be like that. That was the latest installment That's in the Mario cool. Party series. Super Mario Party Jamboree. With new boards, mini games. That's freaking cool. player online gameplay and more. Get ready for the biggest Mario Party in series history. And now... Please take a look at There's this. a lot of new characters that was in there too. Why now this is Zelda. Oh, it's freaking I don't know what this was called. I ain't get him. Bro, just combusted. Now, I forgot what this series was called. Or is this different? This is a Zelda adventure. I mean, it's in the title Zelda, but it's always Link. Echoes of is this a rebate? I don't think this is a rebate. Hello, everyone. I'm Ag Aonuma, producer of the Legend of Zelda series. Oh wow, they're bringing a lot of people into here. What you just saw was the latest installment, the Legend of Zelda: Echoes of Wisdom. This time around, Link has vanished. Now, it's up to Princess Zelda to step into the protagonist role. Yeah, I was about to say. You might be thinking, will Zelda fight with a sword then? Nah. Here, we wanted to create a new gameplay style that breaks conventions seen in past Legend of Zelda games with a top-down perspective. I like your shirt. To explain more, please take a look at this video. Okay. I get I never really played Zelda across the vast lands of Hyrule strange rifts have appeared and have taken many people including Link now alone Zelda meets the fairy Tri receives a mysterious staff called the Tri Rod and sets off on a journey across yeah Hyrule she's like yeah to save her she's like a mage type 
By waving the tri rod at a table she found, Zelda learned how to create an imitation of it called an echo. Once you learn an echo of something, you can recreate it whenever you'd like. What? Even if there's a wall blocking your path, you can create echoes of tables to get a leg up. Oh, Just that's cool. Like that. Okay. You can create wooden there you boxes, go. old beds. Can you create houses? Things like Wait, can you create blocks. people? How you use them separately or together is they, entirely can you create up people? to you. Learn and create echoes of things you this. find while exploring Hyrule. You might be lonely. You might be surprised at what you discover. Yeah, oh, beds. Oh, there's a lot of, like, Even battles will possibilities. Different. You could pick up and throw a rock echo, for example. Oh, that's crazy, that's actually. That's not all, though. You can also create echoes of monsters. <gasps> oh, After my God. So, they'll fight by your side. That's okay. That's cool. Monsters have different abilities. That's cool. So okay. choose the one you want to create based on the situation. Wisdom okay, that's cool. After all. Hey, it's, it, there we go. Play the title. That's okay. That's kind of cool. Yo, Zelda's better than Link. No, I'm kidding. No. But that's cool. In a high rule without Link. The fate of the kingdom is now in Zelda's hands. Yo, can you do echoes of bosses? No, they, that would be overpowered. It'll probably be a miniature size of the, size of the boss. Zelda's wisdom. There are a lot of echoes in this game. To Dude. be honest, I haven't counted them all yet. Uh. How you solve puzzles and battle enemies will change depending on the echoes used. In short, we've created a game where each player's experience will be different. The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom launches September 26th. Yo, that's actually pretty cool. A Nintendo Switch Lite system inspired by the Legend of Zelda series will also be available at launch. We hope you're looking forward to playing as Zelda in this new adventure. Now, I'd like to return this moment I'd stolen away back to Mr. Takahashi. Huh. Thank you, Mr. Aonuma. Please look forward to the newest entry in the Legend of Zelda series. Let's see a few more headlines. Man, show us the movie. <laughs> it's gonna be a live action. Can you believe that? Bro. I used to love Just Dance. The only way I could play Just Dance would actually be on the Wii. Oh, this is not copyright. <laughs> because, yep. Dude, they're always going to be coming out with Just Dance. A new Lego adventure is on the horizon. It's the world of Horizon in Lego form. Join Machine Hunter. Oh, I, I was like, I was trying to think of that game. Evil. Yeah. Journey through lush landscapes. <laughs> Dive deep into the cauldrons. Climb up onto tall necks and traverse other locations inspired by the original game. But be careful. Swarms <laughs> of machines are lurking everywhere. Use an array of gadgets like blast boots and gravity bombs to hunt them down. From the nimble watchers to mighty sawtooths, you might <laughs> even come across the fearsome Thunderjaw. As you progress, you can help Aloy rebuild her home. Man, I don't think I think I have played a Lego game outfits. before, though. Oh, and you don't have to explore this vast wilderness alone team up with familiar faces from the world of horizon in two-player local or online co-op lego horizon huh. adventures launches on nintendo switch this holiday i know i never played horizon A stray's journey begins
Bro, I think I heard of this game. Is it really a journey about a cat? Oh, bro. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Experience a decaying cyber city through the eyes of a cat separated from their family and friends. Explore alongside a drone known as B-12 to find your way home. Carefully climb to the highest heights. Create new paths for yourself. And stealthily Ooh. squeeze into tight spaces. Think like a cat to make your way through the city. Careful, though. Not everyone is excited to have you slinking around, including hordes of hostile creatures ready to swarm. Oh, no. Keep exploring to venture into more areas of this unfamiliar world and make your way back to safety. Yo, the music, though. Stray finds its way onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Dang, I think I heard of that game. Welcome home, Hobbit. If you've ever wanted to live like a hobbit from the Lord of the Rings, now a leisurely existence nestled away in an idyllic, quiet corner of Middle Earth can be yours. I don't know how they can walk Customize around bare your feet. Appearance, decorate your home and settle into life in the Shire. As a newcomer to the little haven of Bywater, you'll befriend your neighbors, work together to solve problems, and even share a meal. Or three, <laughs> explore, garden, fish forage and cook dude the best way to build a hobbit community is by hosting a dinner party with your homemade dishes plus you can trade with your neighbors for unique decorations or special ingredients for even tastier meals friendly hobbits and familiar faces await your arrival when hey it's, uh launches on the Nintendo Switch system i don't know friggin it's surprising i never watched lord of the rings investigate interrogate checkmate I think I know. Yeah, I was about to say. I think I know what this is. Including a sequel that was. Bro, I never watched this. I didn't. I didn't know. Like. Switch as one collection. <laughs> as the prolific prosecutor Miles Edgeworth take the case out of the courtroom and investigate crime scenes, gather information by interviewing people and inspecting evidence, then use the power of logic to solve. Yeah, pretty good. I never watched this. Enjoy all new hand-drawn character visuals from the original series character designer or swap to the original sprites for a more classic look. Oh, that's kind of cool. Take a break from your investigation to explore the gallery where you'll find character art, music, including yeah, I, I, arrangements. A lot of people don't appreciate more. that, but I would definitely Past look at and that. present collide as you uncover the truth at any cost. Ace Attorney Investigations Collection. That's what it's called, right? Or no? No, it's with the little kid. That's Nintendo what I was talking about, but I think I'm talking about the wrong thing. <laughs> Dang and Ropa. They made so many games of this. Think why she kind of. Oh, dang. What the heck? Did say a game? This ain't a game. What the heck is this? Okay. After a devastating attack by unknown assailants, Takumi Samino's life gets turned upside down. A mysterious school mascot suddenly What the heck? While Takumi manages to get out of harm's way, he's then forced to enroll at the Last Defense Academy along with 15 other students. Oh, that's how it gets like because I was about to say they're like with other people, right? But the last one was freaking about a game, right? I don't remember. It's been a long time since I watched Dragon Ropa. And the unavoidable loss of allies. Yep, I about to say. Okay, so they are integrating that with oh this. Okay. Return to his normal life. I was about to say they freaking a lot of them die. I don't like shows like that. You get too attached and then they just die. Huh? Wait, dang it! Wait, that's not dang it, Ropa. Oh, that that I know that design. I know the design. 
A full remake of Romancing Saga 2 is marching on to Nintendo Switch. Bro, a lot of these like hero type games are coming out. Rule like fantasy. Expand, the Empire of Varen across multiple generations while challenging the legendary seven heroes who have turned to darkness. Oh, that's crazy. In combat, use returning saga features like glimmers to learn skills. Oh, it's like that. <laughs> and formations to enhance abilities. Turn-based battles have also evolved into timeline battles, where the action order is key. Innovative features like United Attack can also help with strategy. How will you expand your empire? And in which order will you fight the seven heroes? Oh. Every decision you make will dramatically alter the course of the story. Safeguard your empire's future and protect your legacy from peril. Otherwise, the vengeful seven heroes may emerge victorious. And that's uh, ironic. Romancing Saga 2 Revenge of the Seven launches on Nintendo Switch October That's 24th. actually kind of cool. But Nintendo isn't really like known for the like realistic you're excited to experience the full But it still looks cool. Romancing Saga 2. That's almost everything for today's Nintendo Direct. Oh. Next oh, will dang. be our last announcement. Huh? Take a look. It's already over already? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. It's freaking Metroid. Wait. F Star Fox? It's Metroid. To all the people that said Metroid, you were right. What? For all these Metroid games are telling me to start playing it. Whoa. This looks sick. <laughs> they even made the Metroid ball. Oh, they even got the charge shot. Yo, I ain't playing a game where there's no Ridley, man. Okay, I'm guessing that's the villain. Metroid Prime 4. Beyond. What the heck? That looks kind of cool. Twenty twenty five. That was a first look at Metroid Prime 4 Beyond. After a very long time, we are finally able to share more information about this title. Release is planned for 2025. Whoa. So please wait a little bit longer. We I know, some of these games are from 2025. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Really? Well, thank you for watching. Uh, uh, <laughs> freaking... What? Man, dude. That was... We got some games that I'm excited for. And, of course, there's a lot of games that other people are excited for. What did y'all think of this Nintendo Direct? Was it a little bit underwhelming? Because there was only two things that, like, I am looking forward to, and that's the Super Mario Party thing. And the Donkey Kong thing. Oh, yeah, and the uh, Wii Sports thing with basketball. But everything else, like, you know, they're really cool. But, yo, I was expecting, like, oh, uh, please, why, 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 just please make Tomotachi life, please, man. Like, I was ready for that. I'm like, why do I feel like that it's going to happen?
and then it's not gonna happen. Oh yeah, and did you guys know that like they're gonna be announcing the Nintendo Switch's successor pretty soon? I'm like, yeah, yeah, y'all won't believe this. Literally, it's been seven years since the Nintendo Switch was released. I don't know why it's been like it's been like four years. I, there's no way it's been seven years. Like, oh my gosh. But what games are you guys excited about that's coming out? Like, I want to know. I already, I already told y'all mine. But dude, all right, this Nintendo Direct was okay. I'd say it was okay. But yeah, y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. I hope y'all have a blessed day today. And I'll see y'all in the next one. No, 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 wait.